Uh, so according to Wired, uh, this self-editing action camera uh, is the future of home video. So they, we're thinking like they're showing a camera that's uh, mounted to the side of a helmet. And uh, and I guess this is going to take video and actually, again, self-edit kind of the the best parts of it and kind of have something for you. So I, I, I wish there was a way where some of these would allow you to pick your highlight reel. Right. Uh, where, where, so this is going to be do, doing one of those things where it's going to try to guess and what and whatnot. There may be some of those frames that you definitely want in there that it decides to drop. Um, I think where, where they need to, they need to kind of post the entire video or keep something around the entire video, but then let you try to try to let it set an automatic um, highlight reel, but then allow you to go back in and force pieces you may want to keep in there. Right. There has to be kind of a post editing that, you know, okay, the machine's only going to do so much so well. Oh, sorry, pizza shot. Uh, sorry about that. Uh, but no, yeah, the, it's only going to do so much so well, but there's a certain point where, where a human needs to take the selection. But a lot of times, if you talk about like shot composition, it can figure that out. Like, this is the thing where something happened, right? And that, that's how it knew Chachi walked across in front of the camera in front of Frank doing the accordion, right? They're like, well, this shot is a lot like the one that you saw before, except this thing happened. I bet that's it. that's something worthwhile, right? It's making those decisions. And and if this thing that, I, it's called Grava, G-R-A-A-V-A, getgrava.com if you want to check it out. Uh, this thing claims to do the same thing. Now I'm wondering how much of it is, is it just doing it all in camera? Is it doing it in software afterwards? I think it's mostly doing it in camera. You can add great music to your video via an app that you can connect to it. Uh, so that's fun. So, But, but that idea, that's that's really interesting to me, you know? Uh, and again, isn't this an interesting spot? We've seen this before, haven't we, Chilla? That part where web design and web development has really been um, kind of, the purpose has been defeated because a lot of us can just fire up a squarespace.com and do everything ourselves. Mm -hmm. Now, oh, I'm seeing it in video editing because most people that just need to get a thing done, and, and I, I don't I'm on. I, you know, I'm looking at Craigslist every once in a while. I'm looking at Guru.com, and I see I've seen exactly this. I have a bunch of GoPro stuff that I want edited nicely. Well, if you use this instead, you didn't need to go on Guru and ask for an editor because you probably had mostly what you needed already done for you, uh, depending on how well this works. But uh, maybe this is early. Maybe this is uh, at least, or maybe you just upload everything to Google Photos and it takes care of you, right? Um, but it does feel like that's kind of that next step, isn't it? Yeah, and I'm trying to now. I'm trying to find.